What's going on everybody, it's Coldside bringing you our first double free-for-all chem strike so far from Call of Duty Ghosts by our very own Doom Rinaldi, the guy who got all the beast ones, uh, or the beast double free-for-all moabs in Modern Fair 3, so I'm sure you can expect a lot of beast gameplays like this from him. He's pretty much, I would say, our sole free-for-all player or free-for-all specialist. And it's pretty cool to see him already get a double already. He's using the Remington with the Red Dot and Silencer, which is kind of an, I guess, it's an okay choice. Um, it's The only reason I don't particularly like this weapon is just because it's got 24 uh, bullets in the magazine. So, obviously not the most, but since it's free-for-all, you're really only going to be running into one person at a time anyway. So, I guess it's not too big of a deal. It's got little to no recoil, so it's a pretty good gun. Um, hopefully you guys can kind of learn it. if the biggest tip I can give for you guys on free-for-all is to use your headset I mean sound is probably the most important tool or your most useful tool in this game mode Just because if you're using dead silence and amplify you'll pretty much be able to hear everybody around you and I mean it's definitely a really good uh, method to use in my opinion, so uh, I've heard from other people that free for all is a really good way to get your first chem strike as well. So if you're still struggling for that, maybe try free for all, maybe pump up your headset really loud or something like that. But um, I just wanted to let you guys know about our live stream, which hopefully you already know about because we've posted tons of videos just reminding you guys to go check it out on twitch.tv. Um, but if you haven't for some odd reason, I definitely suggest you do. I think we've been streaming for like probably almost two days straight now 48 hours straight so that's a pretty cool accomplishment um, and it's definitely showed you know we've had tons of viewers on twitch a lot of people are enjoying it so I suggest you guys go check it out the link will be in the description of course um, we're gonna try and stream as much as possible like theoretically we want to stream 24 hours a day every day um, it just really depends on people's schedule and whether or not they actually can stream I know personally I've been the one that's had to stream from like 2 a.m. to 8 a.m., sometimes 9 a.m. So I've been getting the the really bad shifts, and it's been kind of tough. Uh, I'm not going to lie. It's not always the most fun thing when you're playing that late and you're that tired. But uh, at least it's something for you guys to watch. And oddly, en or oddly enough, that's been the time when we get the most viewers. So um, it's been pretty cool. Um, I'm definitely excited for the Twitch channel. I'm glad to see it thriving. Uh, especially with not that much streaming. I mean, we did stream probably two or three times before Ghost, and then after that, um, it's pretty much just been just uh, these past, I guess, weekend or so. So um, definitely suggest you guys check it out. Hopefully, we're going to be getting a subscribe button soon. I think it would be cool if we got our own little subscriber emoticons or whatever as well. Um, I, I don't know. I don't even know what if you guys have any suggestions for a good emoticon Let me know. I'm kind of interested The only thing I can really think of right now is a chem strike icon Although I don't know if I'd want to make that the subscriber icon or not um, And we'd have to think of a pretty good one. I know Jay nasty uh, Has a lot of good or a lot of the good emotes for his twitch because you know, obviously he's got a huge channel on there so um, it would be cool if we could go to that someday. He's been actually really, really helpful and definitely really selfless when streaming. You know, he could be streaming on his own channel, but he's deciding to help us out. So that just shows a lot. Um, so if you guys want to see him play too, you know, he's even dropped a double chem on stream. So he's definitely doing a great job. And I do thank him for that. Um, and like I said, you guys should definitely go check it out. Uh, if you guys check your email, you can follow the stream and it'll email you whenever we go live. Or you can follow us on Twitter, link in the description of course. So pretty much all of those things as you see, picks up the chem strike here, decides to call it in and leaves before it goes off so the game doesn't actually end so he doesn't get the kills for it and joins right back luckily with no really hassle and gets the chem with the hazy screen this time. So, um, But anyways, also we're setting up our own personal website, it's doomclan.tv. Um, we're trying to get all the graphics set and stuff so if you're a good graphic designer or anything like that or even a uh, video effects designer or whatever um, definitely please message us we're definitely looking we're always looking for graphic designers and players while I, I guess I might add that as well so just message us on YouTube um, we check or I check the messages pretty much daily so I'll definitely see it if you send me a message no problem so if you guys know or even if you know anybody that you could suggest that would be really helpful as well. Um, if you guys could go sign up on the forums, I will link, I'll put that 
as like a main link or I'll put it under Rinaldi's name. So make sure after you guys go subscribe to Rinaldi um, to go sign up on the forums. I'm going to try and get everybody from Doom active on that and kind of make it just a place you know you can pretty much go for anything. Not just necessarily to talk to us but to talk to other people as well about random stuff or find out cool new stuff and, uh, and other things like that. I almost said stuff like four times in a row but I'll put that link in the description as well. The actual website, the homepage is kind of going under renovation like I said. We're waiting for, because I don't, personally, I want the site to look really good before it goes live. Uh, we've got like the forums look really good, you know, it's like some service, some pretty good service. So um, I think the forums are fine. And just I want the actual website to look really good. And I'm, I'm just, we're just waiting on some like really good graphics that actually look um, presentable. So. Uh, that's why we're waiting on that. Once once we like officially launch the site and everything, I'll def we'll definitely say it in the video. Or I mean, if you guys really want to, um, if you go to DoomClan.tv right now, it'll show our live stream and a Twitter feed and stuff like that. So if you guys really want to go see it, it's pretty plain, but uh, it, it is up. If you know, if you do want to watch it. Um, but that's pretty much you know all about the website and everything. Uh, hopefully you guys think that's a good idea which brings me to another point is we're thinking about making like doom clan or doom t-shirts and sweatshirts and stuff like that that uh, will sell I'm not sure or maybe we we could probably give away a couple too but uh, if that's something you guys would buy let us know the thing about that is I don't necessarily want to make it like it, it doesn't have to be like call of duty related you know uh, what do I want to say like just like it's not gonna be Call of Duty related just from the shirt, you know. It's not gonna say Call of Duty on it. It's just gonna say Doom, and it, or it may not even say Doom. It may just be our our D logo, and uh, it'll just look like a really sick logo on it. And I think it's something. It's definitely something I would wear, especially since you know I'm in the clan, obviously. But even if I wasn't, like you know, like even like the phase shirts, like some of them actually like look really good. Like the designs are actually really good. And, you know, it's kind of one of those things where, like, you could wear it and people would see, you know, it looks like a cool shirt, but they wouldn't know what it is anyway. So, um, you could definitely just wear it as a regular shirt. Um, and so let me know if that's something you guys would be interested in as well. Um, as soon as the site gets up and running, you know, we get all those things worked out and, you know, everything's situated. I'm sure that will be coming very soon. Um, so a lot of great things happening. If you guys have any suggestions for specific gameplays you want us to go for, of course, leave us a suggestion as well. Um, because I think we're doing a pretty good job of varying the uploads, in my opinion, just from looking back at the last few. There are some series that I'm looking to start soon. We just need to get everybody, you know, like together and figure everything out. Because, uh, like, we just need to get a little bit more organized and then everything will be a little bit better. But um, I'm definitely looking forward to the next, I guess, months or so until Titanfall. Maybe we'll upload some Titanfall when that time comes, but that's getting a little too far ahead. So hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay. Please check out Rinaldi in the description. He's a beast free for all player, uploads a lot. Um, definitely a strong player. Hopefully we can get him streaming soon on Doom as he picks up the final chem strike. And I will be talking to you guys soon. All right, see ya.